Good morning. This is your Monday morning brief for September 8th. I'm Michelle Orzano, CoinWorld Senior Editor for Paper Money. Paper Money dealer Lynn Knight always says if you want to talk paper money, you have to come to Memphis. And he's right, of course, but that conversation can continue year-round when you consider all the auction opportunities available. Just in the last few weeks, nearly 3,000 lots of U.S. and world notes have been offered in public auctions. On August 31st, Bonham sold the Stockton, California collection of national bank notes for $339,300. The collection contained a Discovery Series 1873 $10 note for the First National Gold Bank of Stockton. Ira and Larry Goldberg auctioneers sold a $10,000 Federal Reserve note for $117,500 at Goldberg's September 1st auction in Los Angeles. The note was part of their U.S. Coins and Currency pre-Long Beach Expo auction. And during the Long Beach Expo last week, Heritage sold a rare Confederate 1861 $100 Montgomery note for $23,500. Heritage also sold two rare books of banknote engravings and sketches from the archive of the fabled engraver James Smiley. One of those books sold for $64,000. $625,000 and $30,550. And speaking of Lynn Knight, he will also offer more than 1,300 lots of U.S. and world notes at auction September 17th to 19th. During the sale, Knight will also offer for the first time an entire session dedicated to world replacement notes. It's easy to see there's plenty of opportunities to continue the conversation about paper money. Tell us what kind of paper money you like to talk about. Send us an email at cweditor at coinroll.com. I'm Michelle. Have a good week.